Disneyland is often called the happiest place on earth. On the surface, it does look very nice. Everything is well maintained and there are happy actors all over the place. But Disney has many dark secrets at all of their theme parks. Some of these dark secrets have led to rides and attractions being abandoned for good. From Disney's very first water park that closed mysteriously, to an abandoned airport Disney does not want you to know about. River Country In 1976, Disney's River Country water park was opened. It was their first ever water park and it was very popular. It featured many water rides and pools. But despite its massive popularity, it mysteriously closed in 2001. The water park was built on Lake Bay Cove. It had a rustic vibe and families loved going there on their vacations. People loved the sprawling water park which had many different attractions. It even had its own island named Disney Island. But the main attraction of the water park was a gigantic man-made mountain. On this mountain was a big water slide that everyone loved. The mountain ended at the Bay of the Lake, and that same water from the lake was pumped up and used on the slides. But as fun and loved as River Country was, it's shrouded in mystery today. This is because in the summer of 2002, many people were waiting for it to open up, but they were let down as they were told it was not going to open that summer. People waited in other summers, like in 2003, 4 and 5, for it to open, but to their disappointment, it remained closed. You may wonder, why would Disney close a water park that so many people loved? At first, Disney said it was because of remodeling. But in 2005, Disney said River Country would be remaining closed permanently. Officially, they said this was because there was a low number of visitors. But many people were not convinced by this explanation. After all, thousands of people year after year waited for this park to open. Instead, many believe that the water park really closed because of an incident. This involved the passing away of an eight-year-old boy. An eight-year-old boy once visited River Country, but as he was enjoying the slides, an amoeba went up his nose. Amoebas are organisms that live in lakes, and if they go inside your body, they can be very dangerous. If they enter through your nose, they can get to your brain and literally eat your brain. And sadly, that's exactly what happened to this eight-year-old boy. The amoeba went through the boy's nasal passage. It then reached his nervous system and damaged it, including the brain. After they found out what had happened to the boy, an investigation was launched. They traced the amoeba to the lake. They found many of the same amoeba in Lake Bay Cove. They also found out that Disney's filter systems did not filter out the amoebas. This has led many to believe that this is the true reason why Disney closed the doors of their River Country water park. To this day, River Country has never reopened and it likely never will. Also, now that many people know this very haunting story, they may be put off if it ever did reopen. Discovery Island This island can be found in Disney World, Florida. It was originally called Treasure Island. It's a very large 11.5 acre island in Bay Lake, and the attraction featured many wild animals and exotic creatures. Guests would go there and see exotic birds, reptiles, and even monkeys. There were many attractions on the island, for example, Tortoise Beach, which had, as the name suggests, many tortoises, and Avian Way, which had many exotic birds. The island was also home to a small zoo. However, today Discovery Island remains off-limits and abandoned. Recently, a man was arrested for breaking in and setting up a campsite on the island. He did this during lockdown. The mysterious thing is, Disney never officially stated its reasons for closing this island. There are some legends that say people passed away on Discovery Island. Legend says that this means the island is haunted. But for me, the real mystery is why did Disney close the island? In 2009, an explorer named Shane Perez and his friends went to the island. They say that they came across several strange things. This included reptiles in jars. There were also very creepy old employee photos, and also a pair of aggressive baby vultures. Lake Buena Vista Airport Many people don't realize this, but Disney World once had a fully operational airport. This was built at Disney World, Florida in 1971. You can find it south of the Magic Kingdom Park. 
It was large enough to operate four planes at one time. Guests could go from airports in Orlando straight to Disneyland. If they were going from an Orlando airport, the flight was only a few minutes long, and music was even played for the guests upon landing. However, in the 1980s, Disney built a monorail, and this meant that the airport could no longer be used. Today, the airport is abandoned and is pretty creepy. It sort of looks like a narco-style runway in the middle of nowhere, but it's really near to Disney World. The only thing is, most of the guests and visitors don't even know it exists. Nara Dreamland Nara Dreamland is located in Japan. It was heavily inspired by Disneyland California. The park opened in 1961. Just like in American Disneyland parks, there is a Sleeping Beauty's Castle. There's also a mountain ride similar to Matterhorn, and also a large main street. The park once attracted 1.7 million visitors, but in 2006 it was abandoned and left to rot. Theme parks are full of joy and adventure, until everyone leaves. One man named Romain Velon went into the park one day. He took some amazing images of the very haunting park. Everything from the roller coasters to the teacup rides are totally overgrown. Foliage now covers every single ride. The park looks incredibly creepy. There's a weird mix of it being abandoned yet still bright and colorful. And many people in the city of Nara say that this place is haunted. But now it's time to make your voice heard. Comment below which was the creepiest abandoned theme park on this list. If you want some more amazing videos, then check out my second channel. But as always, thanks for watching. There are some more videos on screen right now. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.